about a year ago I made a video about my G5 RV Junior antenna 40 meters to 10 meters well here it is it's rolled up going to be packed away not that there's anything wrong with it but I wanted 80 meters so what I did I bought myself a 80 to 6 meter off center fed dipole and installed that um, unfortunately as I found out the hard way the yard's not big enough for it so I'll show you what I did well here's the mast if you remember from the last one let's just go up and see what's there yeah, there's a feed line it's now guide to a tree because it was leaning a bit forward due to the um, weight of the coax there it is going to the house and if you go up oh, you can see one of the ends it's going practically on right angles <laughs> uh, you can see it's not in this uh, most ideal sort of setup let's just follow it and see where it goes I'm just standing underneath it let's check the short end following that you can probably just make it out and oh hits that tree and goes off on an angle let's have a closer look at what I did oh, look at that it's a small piece of tubing tethered to this fig tree here and I follow it up and it gets tied off to the fence all right it's pretty neat does the job turn around and there it is let's follow the other end okay there we are let's follow that goes up on the roof where there's a dove and zoom in a bit a bit more it's tied off over there with a short piece of nylon rope it keeps on going and disappears there for the rest I'm gonna to have to climb the roof all right where was I here I am on the roof there it is tied off at that point there you can just make it out or well, you can barely make it out it's tied off at that point there you're gonna walk a bit closer Well, that's made of um, PVC, so it's not too bad. Don't have to worry about it causing any weird behaviour. Runs a bit further, gets tied off there to my 144 440 dual bander. Now, if you sort of think about it, it's set up pretty stupidly. There's a few kinks here and there, bends and turns and whatnot, but it works surprisingly well tell you what I mean once I get down on um, terra firma okay here is a drawing of basically how it is not to scale because I just did it freehand you see over here there's the center feed point on the mast going out tied off to the tree and going to the back fence other end going up on the roof tied off to a pipe taking a bit of an angle tied off to a PVC pipe and ending there now it looks like a off-center bat sort of the way kids draw seagulls in the air <clears throat> but saying that you know it's less than ideal that's perfectly resonant on 40 meters um, tunes up very very easily on 80 um, 20 10 and 6 it's um, does the job really well and if anything I um, got 80 meters whereas the G5 RV junior didn't um, being a smaller antenna but um yeah taught me two things a measure up your backyard first before buying an antenna in case it's too big in this case and b even if it isn't too big such as in this case it still does a pretty good job nonetheless uh, one thing i will uh, um, end with um, both this off center fed dipole and the um, G5 RV Junior were bought from W8AMZ from the US, very high quality antennas, relatively inexpensive and pretty hard wearing, I highly recommend them. I am in no way affiliated with him or them, just a happy customer. See ya.